today I'm going to take apart this Nintendo Wii sensor bar. It has two little black sections and it has five screws on the bot. No, it actually has six. And these screws are a special tri wing security screw. So before I take this apart, I'm just going to see if this senses or transmits because I saw some videos on YouTube of people replacing the sensor bar with two candles. So let's see if that actually is possible. So I will turn on the sensor bar by turning on the Wii that it's connected to. And as you can see, there are five little purple dots on each little side section. So those are infrared transmitters. Here's proof. This is a DVD player remote. If I push a button on it, it's a little LED lights up purple. So, so now I'm going to take this apart and then we'll see the internal wiring on the inside. So turn off the Wii that it's connected to and unplug its cable <clears throat> so that we do not damage the console. There are six of these screws. And I have a special tri-wing security screwdriver bit for my screwdriver. These screws are kind are kind of tight. And I'm not sure if how big the LEDs are, or if this will use surface mount LEDs. And the cable is super thin. Let's open it up. Whoa. What? That is a little different. So, the front cable. First, okay, let's zoom in a little. The so front cable goes through, goes, okay, I'm gonna, okay, so I lock the focus so the front cable goes through there, goes through a knot, and then goes onto this little circuit board here, with five LED emitters, and these are through-hole LED emitters, and then there's a wire that goes to the second side with five more LED emitters. So I will take all these circuit boards out. Okay. So I've unlocked the autofocus. And we'll see if there okay, so this LED board has has a resistor on it. This is a close up of that little resistor. So there are five LEDs, and then the cable, the second board, the second board has five more LEDs, and another resistor. So I'm going to do a really stupid thing and power this up. While it is open, I'm going to try connecting the cable back to the console, and turn it on. Oh, I think the LEDs lit up. And so all five, and so five LEDs oops, on this side lit up, and the five on this side lit up. So how transparent is the black plastic? Um, it is totally transparent to IR. Well, I think it is opaque to visible light. It is completely transparent to visible light. That's weird. Like, look at this. It lets IR totally through and does not let any visible light through. That is weird. So, I think that's it for this teardown. And I'm probably going to keep the uh, 10 infrared LEDs. So I think that's it.